I'm praying for their conversion before it's too late. Let me tell the whole world, the whole world, not just these puppets, the whole world. Let me tell you, my dear friend, no matter how advanced you have in that technology field, no matter how advanced you are in the scientific, medical, military, let me tell you, you will never, ever be able to stop death because there is one in heaven called the Almighty God, creator of everything and everyone visible and invisible. He is the source of that life. He is the only one who gives life and the only one who takes it. It is at his call, life come into existence and it is also at his call, life is taken from this realm. His name is Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the love and the crown of my head. What has the world become? I don't want to preach. I want to talk to my children. It's not about preaching. You're not coming here to gain information. Oh, oh, I didn't know that the Holy Bible said this. Oh, now today I found out a new information. It's not about information. <clears throat> Do you wish to know him? Are you interested in knowing him? Have you gone astray? Have you checked yourself lately to see where you are? How far, how lost, how, dis how, live how, how miserable you are? Where are you? Stop saying I'm educated. Stop saying I'm knowledgeable. Stop saying I have this certificate in PhD. I'm a, I have doctorate in theology. Who gives one penny about your doctorate? You're an idiot when you do not stand on the pulpit and speak the truth with no reservation, with no hypocrisy. You are an idiot. You're lost. Your PhD will get you to hell, my dear friend, if you do not repent before your Lord. In fact, what destroyed the church is these PhDs. Again, church leaders became boastful about their knowledge of the Bible, not of Christ. <laughs> they don't want to live with him. They just, they just want to talk about him. If you stop at the level of talking about the Lord only, you'll end up in hell. I guarantee you this. I've tried it. Please, this is about you and your God. Where are you with your Jesus? Where are you?